Most Final Cut editors work in project timelines, and as pointed out in the previous lesson, there are times when we would like to deviate from the current state of our edit, but retain a copy of what we have at present. There are two ways to do this with projects. The first method is very straight up, but has one caveat. Here I have a project timeline with some clips in it. If I select it in the browser, go to the Edit menu and choose Duplicate Project. Or I can simply right click the project in the browser directly and select Duplicate Project. Or even quicker, I can use Command D. This gives me a duplicate of my project. I can start to continue my edit in this new project. My old project is left untouched. Um, mostly. Uh, remember I said there is a caveat, right? Okay, so the exception is multicam and compound clips. Since these have a directly connected relationship to their parent in the browser, as discussed in the previous lesson, any changes made to these in the new project copy will affect the copy in the original project timeline and the parent copy in the browser. Let's take a look. I have a compound clip in the project I duplicated. Here it is in the original. I'll switch to the copy I made, double click it to open it in its own timeline, and I'll make a change. Okay, now I'll go back to my project copy. See, there's the change, right? Now, I'll go back to the original project timeline, look at the original version of this compound clip, and I can see the changes taking place here also. Oh man, that's not good. But don't fret, y'all. There's a way to deal with this. If you're using multi-clips and or compound clips in a project timeline and you want to freeze a copy of it that won't be affected by future edits at all, there is a way to do this. I'll select my original project in the browser again and create a project snapshot. To do this, I can go to the edit menu, right click, or use the shift command D shortcut. A project snapshot takes my project timeline as it currently is and freezes it in time. Any multicam or compound clips that reside in it will not be affected by changes made to them in any other timeline. Think of it this way. A project snapshot cuts them off from the parent so they are left totally alone, frozen in time. This is a very simple, yet very powerful and useful way to version our project timeline edits.